be fair, before we get into like nostalgia about what 2021 was, there still was a decent amount of shit that happened this past week in music. So we might as well just kind of, you know, reflect on it. I think the most immediate thing that I kind of, we spoke about offline before jumping on was the, uh, the Drake removing his nominations from the Grammy. Like, mm. Variety's reporting that uh, Drake was nominated, I think, for two categories. I think hip-hop artist or hip-hop album of the year. And then I think, like, record of, or song of, uh, hip-hop song of the year for Way Too Sexy. Um, and he decided uh, today on December 6th to withdraw um, his nomination. So your thoughts on, like, an artist doing that? Because I've never heard of this before. Yeah. In my opinion, I think it's absurd. Um, like, you're being nominated for this thing. And I, I guess you have every right to be like, I don't want to be a part of this organization or whatever. But in my right mind, it's like, you should just make that a permanent decision. And obviously, he's not going to make that a permanent decision. And he's clearly doing it for, uh, what's the, the phrase I want to say? Like, to his advantage because he knows he's probably not going to do well or whatever. Um, so that's my issue. And then it also bothers me because I'm like, do we care about this uh, award ceremony or not? Because when rappers win these Grammys, they're shoving it in your face and doing all this kind of shit. But when they, they don't win, they're like, uh, oh, it's a bunch of white people yeah. out of touch and like, fuck the ceremony and everything. So I think clearly it's... I think it's a wrong move, in my opinion. A bad move. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. I know we have a couple of listeners who know, like, I'm a fucking Drake stan. Uh, but it's probably going to be the first time I actually, like, I completely agree with you on, like, anti-Drake's move right now. Because, yeah, it, it looks like a pussy move, to be completely frank, bro. Like, um, it'd be one thing if you didn't even... Because you have to submit your bodies of work for consideration. So, fam, you can't submit your work. They review it. Okay, they decide where they want to put it. And then you're like, nah, 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 I'm good, bro. Let me take it back. It's <laughs> like, it's, it's, dude, it's, it's common sense to connect the dots. So his album wasn't picked for album of the year of the whole Grammys, but two other hip hop albums were one of them being Donda. So again, I, I'm sure him and, again, him and Kanye are fine, but you clearly know you're not going to win hip hop album of the year if your hip-hop album wasn't also nominated for like it's just fucking like it is like a fucking genius to fucking see this so mm-hmm. i think it's just a petty move like you're like nah yeah like your point like, fuck the grammys like you know because i remember when the weekend didn't get nominated for shit two years ago drake was the first one raising his hand like this is fucking trash blah 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 but then you a year later proceed to nominate i mean like submit your album for consideration like come on fam like you can't have it both ways either don't submit shit and say this thing is all bullshit we'll make our own thing which is fine but don't kind of want to be a part of it you want the accolades and then when you don't when you see like you're not it's not going to go your way you're like nah i'm fucked this but like that's that's a bitch move to me yeah I, I i don't know if like there's any like what a possible ulterior motive could be for doing that like if if you were to defend this if people flame him but i mean i think it's a smart move in the sense of you know the, the idiots on fucking instagram won't clown him for like a whole month or whatever if he loses but at the same time like you said i think uh, if it has to do with like the whole ego and just wanting to be respected and the, as the winner then i think it's it's really lame that we've come to this point where people can you know change things and you know like resubmit their music and pull out of award ceremonies and stuff because because then it really shows you that this is all about the business and not like just releasing good music and and leaving it as is totally dude because my thing is like all right you the the nominations come out you see you're probably not gonna win then just don't go you know what i mean like you don't have to go but to fucking just say i don't want to participate anymore it just seems like that corny kid at the basketball court, like, grabbing his basketball because he wasn't picked. Like, all right, I'm going home. Fuck yeah. Like, mm-hmm. bro, like, come on, man. Like, you're better than that. Again, I'm sure he's going to spin this shit. Drake's phenomenal marketing genius. Like, I'm sure there'll be another reason why he comes out with it. But, I'm, like, as of right now, this shit just came out today. Like, it just looks like you knew you weren't going to get fucking picked and you're mad about it. So, like, yo, I don't want to be a part of it. I'm like, for that reason, like, just don't go. Like, just don't go. Yeah. Yeah, it was a very odd move. And even if it does, like, 
help him in the sense of, well, if, if you're not there or part of the nominations, you, it's impossible to lose. I feel like it'll still leave a bad taste in a lot of people's mouths that, you know, you're just backing out at the last minute because you feel like you're not going to have your way. Yeah, and then I also wonder how it works is like now we're removing your album from consideration. Does someone else get to jump in? You know what I mean? Like, is it now like yeah. those five nominations go back to some like, you know what I mean? Like, that's just weird. Like, so does it have to spot? be five or like I a certain number? Five. I think it's five. I think, okay. yeah. I mean, I don't have front of it, but I think it's like five. Yeah. So, like, now, like, did you just take a spot from someone else who was kind of on the borderline and like they would have been thrilled to just be fucking nominated, right? Because, like, at the end of the day, this is all subjective. Like, which the thing is, like, which is weird is that remember when like Travis was like super butthurt in like 2019 when he didn't win for Astro World? And like mm-hmm. Drake went up there and like gave a great speech and said, hey man, as long as your fans love you, that's all that fucking matters. For you to turn around two and a half years later and be like, well, fuck yeah, my fans love me. I don't want to be a part of this. And bro, don't submit your shit for consideration. Like, this is pretty simple. Like, you don't yeah. have to submit your stuff to the Grammys for them to consider you as a, a body of work for them. And I feel like that's easy to say the whole like, well, your fans love you anyways. Or like, you're a millionaire anyways. Like, who cares? But I've, once you've made it to that point, like, and you have all the money and you already have fans, like, there is no other recognition you can, like, strive for except for right. a Grammy. Like, right, that's That's, it. like, like that's... the ultimate prize. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah dude. So, again, it, it's interesting. I just figured we should bring that one up because, again, it's, at least for me, like, that's, like, the... Dude, Drake does a lot of things. I usually, like, yeah, I get it. Good for him. Like, this one, I'm just like, bro, that is... I can't give you like a light skin pass for this one, bro. This is way, <laughs> this is way too much. <laughs> yeah. I'm curious to see what, uh, if any like further details on this will come out. Cause I feel like he's relatively quiet about stuff unless he really has to talk about mm-hmm. it. Um, but I don't know. I mean, I'm sure like academics will talk about it for hours and get yeah, like, yeah, his yeah. take, but I'm curious yeah. if he'll defend him too. I think he will. I think he definitely will. Um, but then, like, so what are your thoughts? Like, like the, do you think it's just him, like, being butthurt? Or is it just him? I don't know, like, would you, like, what do you think, like, from his point of view, the, the, the advantage of this is? Because, like, for me, it's kind of like, there is no loser in this. Because, again, you're all mm-hmm. nominated. So it's kind of like, you always put that on your resume, which, whatever. Yeah. But, like, at the end of the day, dude, CLB did the biggest numbers of any album this year. Like, mm-hmm. so you already won, fam. Like you already won. It's like I just don't understand like the upside of this, right? Which is like I'm intrigued to come like see what comes up. Like I wonder what yeah. your ideal situation for Drake. Like, why do you think he does it? In my mind, the only thing I could think of was it just prevents this whole Donda versus CLB conversation from coming up again and him having to deal with all that shit. Even if he may not be super phased by it, I feel like him backing out, uh and not having to deal with the potential of losing um, just means that he can distance himself from whatever bullshit that was flooding the media for the past couple months. Uh, I don't know if, if he necessarily cares about whether he wins or not more than the conversation just being there and existing still. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You sold the most, but really, we know who the best album really was, kind of a thing. Yeah. Um, do I wonder if it's like Kanye now that they're playing, yeah. like, bro? Like, <laughs> let me just like, I don't want you to win best rap album, but uh-huh. I, you know what I mean? Like, that, that'd be I was crazy. thinking about that'd about be crazy. that a little bit when you asked me the question. I was like, what if Kanye and like this whole uh, charity thing they just got together and he's like, yo, like. Come on, man. Like, it's just for do my this mom. one favor for it's me. For yeah, my for mom. my mom. <laughs> or if, like, Con- Drake, yeah, he, like, guilt tripped Drake into being, like, like, I know I was going to win, but whatever. Like, you can have this one. Damn, that'd be wild. If, like, it's all, like, still some, like, we get, like, a documentary, like, in five years, like, it was all that. Like, he's like, bro, <laughs> you know what? Have this one, dog. Have it, dog. It's for your mom. Like, again, that'd probably be dope, but it would have to be something like that for me to give him a pass. Because as mm-hmm. of right now, like, he just looks like, I ain't trying to lose in the public. It's like, bro. Like, yeah. Uh, we'll get to your song and it's like later on, but like that's what I feel like. Uh, like I've been thinking, like it feels like you have to be willing to lose to actually mm-hmm. finally like reach a new level, right? I feel like yeah. When we were, when we were like uh, critiquing CLB, we were like at least Kanye has like nuances to this shit, right? 
on Donda. Like, Drake shit is just Drake over and over again, which, again, it's mm-hmm. fire. Like, dude, I did my fucking Apple Music shit and fuck, I listened to Drake more than anything else and CLB was the number one album, but still, like, it's just another Drake album. Nothing yeah. changed. So I feel like him not willing to do that maybe is why he's just like, all right, fine, let me definitely not lose, you know, because I already won part of this by the numbers. I don't want to take any L's whatsoever. Yeah, 100%. And that's why, like, I'm not sure if I feel comfortable, like, suggesting he uh, backed out because he was afraid of losing just because I know sometimes the media will, like, force feed us a random story and then... Mm -hmm behind the scenes maybe Kanye did say something but like Drake doesn't or whoever but Drake doesn't want to throw these parties under the bus so he just doesn't sure. say anything and then all we can do is speculate but who knows either way it's super strange because I can't strange, recall though. the last time this ever happened. I've never heard of this before I've heard I didn't of, even like, know you could rappers do rappers getting snubbed um but I've never heard of a rapper or artist sorry just saying you know what you nominated me go fuck yourself I'm not gonna yeah. like I, I get it I, I've, there's been multiple times where like Jay Z hasn't gone because he doesn't appreciate the way that like back in the day like the Grammys would even put like the hip hop nomination on national TV blah 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 like I get that that's like a protest but yeah. to just this is simply just seems like I know you're not gonna pick me so I'm not gonna like be a part of this like that just seems like petty. Mm-hmm. Same. 100%.